Good afternoon, traders. It is Monday, March 12th, 2018, and the U.S. stock market is closed. We had one of, another one of those kind of frustrating, go-nowhere kinds of days today, and we've had just too many of these. It's getting very uh, irritating although it's really not causing our equity uh, uh, to dive catastrophically. It's just, you know, we got so used to having such fantastic trading in uh, December and January and even February, although it wasn't hugely profitable, we had some Real, a couple really good days, and so far in March, we're just kind of, we're just not going anywhere. The Dow, uh, you can see what happened, you know, on Friday we had this huge rally, and the Dow really broke out of a um, congested area there, and uh, is definitely made, making good progress toward recovery, except it couldn't follow through today. And that's, the problem is that, you know, traders are uh, anywhere but unanimous about uh, the upside trend here. And they seem to come in and start selling as soon as things get too high. And this morning, uh, the Dow opened up very nicely and then ended up selling off all day. And this is a bad pattern for us. Tends to get us in the stocks up here. And then those stocks end up not going anywhere. And that's kind of what happened today. Um, but anyway, we, we ended up closing out positive $2,000. That was okay, but... Again, this morning on the open, everything was much better. And by the end of the day, things aren't looking so good. We got into six new positions. Two were positive, four were negative, And we're holding negative $3,700 in open trade equity going in tomorrow. So... That is not so good. You know, we close out positive 2000 and we get into new stuff that is negative uh, 3700 So that's not how you make money. So it was a little bit disappointing. But again, you know, we've, we've gone through uh, periods of time when we're sometimes losing fifteen and twenty thousand dollars in a day and we're not seeing anything like that here right now it's just it's just we're not seeing any nice big up days at least so far in march we're not so hey maybe it'll be tomorrow we'll just have to wait and see i will um show you just a couple stocks here this is the one that really, uh, oh, wait a minute, that, that's not what I wanted to show you first. This is what really uh, killed any chance of having a good day today. This is um, Intrepid Potash Incorporated uh, IPI. And this, we've, we've had some good trades in this, but... This this one was horrible. This reminds me of trading futures. We had this uh, big spike here toward the end of Friday. We get filled here almost at the high of that, and it immediately retreats from there. You know, no, not even for a second did we have any profits with this trade. It pulls back immediately, closed. Um, decidedly against us on Friday and then it gets down here farther stopping us out and that costs us uh, $5,000 there negative $5,000 so 
any time you start out the day, first hour, negative 5,000, probably not going to be a very good day, and that's kind of what happened today. We did have one good trade to kind of offset this, and that's why we're really not showing terrible statistics today. And this is uh, LITE, which is Lumentium Holdings Incorporated. And we had bought this back on Thursday. It had closed against us on Thursday. On Friday, it moved high enough here to keep us in the trade. And coming in here this morning, it pops up again there, really nice there. And we get out of this with positive $4,000. Now, I would have liked to have just said, okay, thank you. Uh, but we get re-entered here. And it, it looks real good at, at the start. Seems to be holding up pretty good, but then kind of retreats today just a little below where we got in. So, you know, we may be okay with this, but this um, isn't looking real beautiful right now. Anyway, that's the way it went. A little frustrating day. This is Trader Bob signing off. We'll be back here tomorrow on Tuesday.